What's going on everybody and welcome to the full game walkthrough series episode 196 Today we continue our journey throughout the Sardonyx First off, I want to let you all know that the test realm updates have officially arrived in the uh, live realm um, Expect some more videos covering uh, the Aphrodite plant boss which supposedly dropped some really amazing gear um, and jewels and whatnot from Darkmoor, which is the gold key new skeleton boss. Um, the one shot gauntlets are out in the crown shop, jewel crafting, and you know, all those little get them goods. Um, and then maybe be able to get that mount that I got in the test realm, but <laughs> oh my, my luck in the test realm is like a hundredfold for what it is in the. Uh, live realm, so I'll have to see about that. Alright, so let's head to the market today, team. I ac accidentally, yesterday, was trying to figure out where the iron gate was. And it juiced, and it, like, zoomed me in. But it's just basically, um, I'll show you. Uh, just over here, iron gate. That was my Ezekiel. So yeah, let's go to the market. There is a peculiar feeling in the air. Tastes hot, acrid. The shadow is suffocating them. Oh. Alright, to the courtyard, huh? Bum 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 bum. Zartika Zhang Zian, Sardonyx, if what? you prefer, has always been ruled equally by the Troika. I'm just gonna accept the fact that that makes sense. One member is a representative of the Honorable Warrior Sisters, the Hunters, like myself. One is a leader of the savvy and well-traveled Trader Sisters, or Merchants. And one is a male. <laughs> if Zelda the Phantom Knight was demoted, as you said, this bodes ill. Well, I mean, it is what it is, Zaro Zinnia. Oh, let's get some of this. Comet Tail, the rare agent Stardust. Oh, I'm st uh, I'm struggling. All right, residential area. Oh, is this where she lives? <gasps> I remember those people. Wait, where are we going? I'm confused. This oh. area is taken up by estates of the old families, and halt! You there, Warlord Baylor orders you to come with us, or you'll face our spears. What? You have no idea who we are, do you? Uh, defeat these people? Okay. Um, put on our... Oh yeah, see now team, the socket system, it's here. So yeah, that's actually kind of interesting. I actually want to talk about that for a bit. Um, so, I don't know if there's like, ha or has been found, like the best setup for jewels as of right now. I don't think there has been. Um, that's going to be an interesting thing. Well, for these next month or so, figuring out what's good. Uh, well, I don't think there's one right way of how things are good. But I will say this. The, <clears throat> the new gear from Aphrodite, <laughs> one of the pieces gives 20 resist, 20 some resist to all of the... Uh, spirit schools which is insane like i mean <laughs> for jading that's that's unreal um i think you for like if you have a good pet you can go immune to like I think, what, four schools <laughs> i mean it, it, it's it's actually amazing but still kind of like whoa um but that'll definitely be the uh the unrivaling or the unrivaling the uh the challenge for some time to come uh you know settling in with this update dragon spire fishing as well don't forget about that um just a lot of little things really i'm excited i'm not really scared it's just that <laughs> i hope the drops are fluent basically that's about it yeah because i know like I don't know if, like, the jewels are set to drop from certain bosses. That's one thing I, I don't know if it's a confirmation or not. And I just got stuck. But I'm pretty sure they would be, wouldn't they? 
it makes sense. But then again, I think some people have said they've got different jewels. The same boss that are better. So maybe there's just like a lot of them that they drop. That'll be that'll be something I'll find out later on, huh? Well, we have enough for a hit, but we're stunned. Oh yeah, Zara Zinnia gives a 20 accuracy, 25 pierce, which is fantastic. Yeah, we'll hit. So yeah, check that out today, team. Um, I'm gonna see if I'm trying to like think about if I'm actually gonna do a series on my death for the uh, jewel actual crafting throughout the um, the time. I'm pretty sure that I will though. We'll have to see what what you know what all we can do. Might even be able to do like two worlds or two to three worlds in one F. Um, I'll definitely look into that team. So now I don't know when I would start it. Probably this week. Sometime. There's actually a lot of stuff to do for that one. Well, that's a little intense. We kill. We did. For the block as well. Awesome. Let us move away quickly before more guards come. All right. Oh, to her actual house. Chad's the terrible mind. Hosa, Mantis Trader. Oh yeah, this is the way to the um, Conda Desert. We'll be making there, making our way over there fairly soon this enough. This is my family estate. It is hard to be back here after all I've seen in the world. Humble beginnings, Zarozinia. <clears throat> Humble beginnings. Kind of the same when I return to my dorm and realize how cheap I am. Leave me be for a bit. Go back to Ezekiel while I see what I can find out. Alrighty. An Amantis citizen. Well, there you are. <laughs> Sardonyx population, like, 30. <laughs> I don't know. I guess they were either all sadly killed or they just, like, fled. Let's hope, hope, let's hope they fled. We don't want anybody dead. Ezekiel. I'm sure much has changed for Zarazinia. And as a young nymph, she would have bought fully into the Shadow Queen's rule. But we must show all the people how much things have changed. To spread the message, we'll need help. Take these letters to my brother monks, Zed and Hosa. Tell them to light the mana fires outside their posts. Easy, Ezekiel. All right. Well, back to Hosa. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, Sardarmix isn't that bad. Not that bad at all. Then again, I don't remember all of what it actually entails, so... What do you got here? Greetings, Spellbinder. What it are those? It is an honor to meet you. Let us light the mana fire together. <clears throat> What's inside those buckets, mate? Brother Zed's post is in the market. Some type of green goo? I mean, you do you. Alright. Zed. Got something the palace courtyard maybe no he's over here oh yeah he's on the opposite end kind of a journey to get to him though oh he's in here sorry the place has been ransacked and there's no sign of zed about best tell ezekiel <laughs> he doesn't have to know <laughs> excuse me he does not have to know ezekiel though Zed's dead? Oh, whoa! No one ever said that. Zed might not be dead, but his post has been ransacked and there was no sign of him. I knew Warlord Baylor might retaliate. Since you bested her, the Elder the Phantom Knight has been meditating in the market. She may be willing to talk about Zed. Okay. Wait, where's she at? This way? I thought the market was the op- Oh yeah, we can go around. I forgot. There's like a little get him good path. All right, Zelda. Hello. You have already bested me once, Spellbinder. Must you shame me more this day? I mean, why not, though? Brother Zed is gone, his post ruined. I had not heard this grim news. 
The warlord's reach grows bolder with each passing hour. Mm-hmm. As I told you, I am no longer an insider, even more now with my humiliating failure. I can tell you nothing about Zed's fate. Wow. If I were you, I would seek out Nadeza the Spicier. She rules the merchants and sits on the council. I mean, if she sees them spices, she herself is a spicy one. Oh, she's literally right here. Oh. Could I know you, stranger? Oh. Brother Zed, is he supposed to have done something seditious? He isn't part of the anarchistic fifth column, is he? No. He should have many friends around the market. Let me give you a list of houses to check. Alrighty. So maybe he's like hiding out with some some friends. <laughs> Citizen. Brother Zed? No, no, I, I haven't seen him. <laughs> Who are you talking about? Zed, get out of here. I love how they're so vaguely named citizen merchant. Like, okay. <laughs> I didn't see anything. I don't know anything. Please, leave. Are you being told if you don't tell me stuff, they'll give you a cookie? I feel like that's what's going on here. Wait, where's he at? Excuse me? This house is dark. You think you heard someone locking the door when you came up. No one answers your knock. Something spooky, team. Listen. I don't know anything about Zed. Who sent you? Please, don't let the sentry see you talking to me. So there is something going on. Spicy, we need to talk. Make our way. We're, we're doing like these, uh, you know like in those races? Those little like blockades, they go fast around them. These are like literally our vroom vrooms. Don't mind me, team. Just had a, had a little moment there. Alright, Spicy, hello. You are still looking into Zed's disappearance. You are tenacious, aren't you? I just talked to you like two seconds ago. Come on now. After you What's this? Out, I made some inquiries. There are many strange and troubling stories flitting about Sardonyx. From what I gleaned, Brother Zed was seen in the Tower of Pale Beauty. That is a moth place. So I don't know what he's up to. I would stay out of the affairs of moths and mantises if I were you, stranger. But if you must continue looking, look there. I kind of have to, Spicy. Zeke, this place is crazy. We gotta get out of here. Let's go back to Wizard City, huh? Alright, put on our boss deck. So yeah, that'll be interesting, team. Um, I just dropped my chapstick. That's a thing. Spellbinder. The Shadow Queen warned us you'd be sniffing about. Warm blood. Hairless mouse. Antenniless freak. Wow. I knew you'd be searching. For this useless traitor Zed, prepare to be beaten and caged. I think you have it switched around there. I'm gonna be getting you, Hook Tip. <clears throat> All right. Well, um, myth. I mean, <sighs> reliquary. Why not? <laughs> For fun. For funsies, right? Alright. That's a little unnecessary, don't you think? Plus 25. Alright. Uh, we'll enchant the calendar because we can. Um... We have a minus 25, which... I mean, it matters, but then it doesn't matter because they're probably going to use something else. <clears throat> I mean, they'll probably use it again, right? Ooh! Ooh! Sorry. <laughs> Midnight. Look at you. And what are you doing? Oh! Well, now he has a myth shield on him. A little aggressive. See, now... Yeah. I mean, minus 50, minus 25. I mean, the thing is...
Okay, so we do have one of those. Um, we got a Phantom. I need to blade again. It's kind of an interesting battle because we're going to boost on both of these people. But the thing is, it's, yeah, like yesterday when I was talking about, like, school specific, like, shielding is, like, really kind of, like, not that often. You know, they don't, they don't shield that much. But, like, I don't know. It's interesting because balances still are antsy with their, like, minus 25s and stuff. That's kind of like the same thing with, like, ice and their tower shields. Something to think about. Uh, yeah, we need a blade. That's pretty darn important. I think I'm going to faint again just because I don't have pierce or anything. I mean, honestly, who would have thought that he would have used the Jaguar guy, right? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe th maybe that one's just me, but was not was not seeing that. Um, yeah, Saga of Heroes, but it is my last turn for this. Um, kind of the, uh, I think we're going to hit anyway. <clears throat> if I had one more round on the Reliquary, it would have been perfection. It would have been. Less crit based Ivan. Oh my. I tried. Oh yeah, he's dead. He tried, but he's dead. We literally have the power of Sardonyx on our side. Remember earlier, yesterday, we had to repair a Mystic Colossus. Minus 45, though! Really? I believe. <laughs> I, I don't know. Here we go. I believed that it happened. But that's a very rare case. <laughs> okay. Well, we do have a calendar, which is basically... The most ideal thing I've seen all day. So we have two blades. Uh, we need to faint. I think... Yeah. And then we'll be able to kill, I think, in two or three rounds. Mana burn, though. Well, that just delayed it a bit. Um. Well, yeah, now we gotta faint. Basically, starting from scratch. So... Balances around this time of the world are pretty intense, actually. I mean, mana burn, minus 45s, but, I mean, it's like PvP. Uh, yeah, double faint. I didn't say it, but I knew Dwarken was somewhere in this room. <laughs> I knew it! Alright, now I'm just gonna mass pass. Mass pass. Makes sense. Oh, he has to use one of these. It wouldn't be tradition if he didn't. This is gonna do a bit. That's a lot. Any any hit that does that much? Yeah. Eh, about a round or two use reliquary. And double faint, double blade. Minus 25, but doesn't really matter. We should kill. Alrighty. Reliquary, and then GG next. What are you using? Vengeance. <laughs> Alrighty. <sighs> See ya. And then the minus 25 to rain on our parade. Whenever I see that center face, I'm just like, <laughs> I feel like he talks to me like, hey, Blue. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, 
<laughs> like I said, it's one of those days. Uh, blinded by the light, I cannot escape the death spiral. That's really cool. So polished blocking sapphire. See, team, the different variety of um, jewels you can get. That's our first one as well on our myth, which is fantastic. A lot of potential, team. That was amazing, Spellbinder. Can you get me home? A lot of potential, which I... Which, I mean, it changes the game, and... Yeah, I love that. Alright, we're Zed. Secure Zed, oh. So we freed him, and now we have to go make sure he's tucked in, bake him some cookies. You know, the whole nine yards team, really. Make sure he's feeling good. Feeling back where he used to be. Zed. By the stars, I don't know how you knew where to find me, but I cannot thank you enough. You are allied with Ezekiel? I want to clean up this place a bit, mate. Ezekiel sent you to find me? Please, let me see his message. Oh, oh my. He thinks you are... Hm. Well then, can you help light the mana flame? With luck, the symbol will inspire more and more mantises to rise against the Shadow Queen. Isn't that your job, though? Once that is done, can you find Odessa the Spicier and tell her what befell me with that dreadful moth Drepper Hooktip? I don't think Nadeza meant to betray me, nor do I think she fully realizes the depths of the Shadow Queen's evil. Besides, everyone deserves a second chance, eh? Depends on the chance. Depends on what they've done. But maybe. Upon lighting the mana flame, you sense more and more mantises peering curiously at you. I don't see anybody though, Grandmother Raven. Few look openly, but you feel many eyes and antennae on you. They watch from behind windows and around corners. <laughs> they spying on me. They've been doing it the whole time. What? <laughs> oh my. Oh, back to spicy. Oh, here we go. Oh, we made it. Oh, oh, oh. 100%. 8 out of 8. Hello. You. Wait, what? I mean, I did not expect to see you again. You defeated Drepper Hooktip and freed Zed? Is it wise to tell me this? Zed specifically told you to talk to me about the monks of Lost Light and the Fifth Column and the Shadow Queen? The open air is no place for this kind of talk. Come inside. Interesting. She lives up to her name. Wait, am I gonna have to kill her? No. I don't want to kill Spicy. I'm trying to remember, but I feel like we actually have to kill her. Well, that, that makes me a little sad. I think. I could be wrong, though, but I'm pretty sure. You seem wary, anxious. What do you think is going to happen here? I will make some tea and you will tell me what you need to. Tell me of where you come from. Or what you saw on the far side of the Starfall Sea. Or what you believe the Shadow Queen desires. Wait, what was that noise? Traitors! They all say, come with us to jail and execution. Or else we kill you now. Foolish creature! I am Nadeza the Spicier, one of the ruling members of the Troika. I order you... Silence! They lost say, take you too! Okay, so at least it's not Spicy who's betraying us. And those lag, or those drop frames, the lag, what was that? Um, okay, we'll put on our attack deck again. Got a little worried there that Spicy was the one that was going to try and kill us, but it's Baylor's henchman. I forgot to remove these as well. Um, I mean shield, really. Not much else we can do. Um, perfect. Now he's got to cross our fingers, cross our toes, that we get a shadow pit. Oh, also, thank you for the people who were commenting yesterday, talking about how a Shadow Pip equals, <clears throat> and it's confirmed, five pips. Which, it makes sense because of, you know, 
the damage and everything that they do. Um, so that's that's something to think about every time you get a shadow pip. That's that's five pips, basically all juiced into one, which is I think that's pretty cool. Can we get a? Um, oh, we don't have any more blades. Well, I guess we'll faint, huh? Why not? I still think we'll kill when we get a shadow pip, but probably should not have wasted that frog. But I got greedy. We'll have to restock our TCs, possibly talk to McMuffin for next before next step. The TCs do fly out. I don't realize how fast they actually go. Um, yeah, we'll faint. And hopefully next. Oh yeah, people were asking me, do I believe in rituals to get shadow pips faster? Well, there really is no ritual to get them faster. It just... I don't know. If you don't think about them, they happen. I guess? I don't know. And then some people get them, like, within the first or second round, which... Seems like Storm always gets them that early. I don't know, it's weird. Because, I mean, the amount of times I've been in Dark War and whatnot. For, uh, Shane. Frankenstein, huh? Not bad, not bad. Come on, Midnight. Work some voodoo for me. Oh. <laughs> See, that's the thing. I was greedy, and now I'm paying for it because I discarded that frog. Just the way it rolls. <laughs> I was gonna say, psych, we got it, but I didn't want to feel bad because I didn't want to hurt the frog's feelings. I mean, the the frog, that double infection though. That's dangerous. I mean, is this mantis a man or a female? I don't know. Or male or female. I feel like the, the Mystic Colossus resembles Zaro Zinnia, so we're just going to go with the she. She lays down the law every time she enters the uh, battlefield. I mean, it does look somewhat like the leg. Zaro Zinnia, I don't know. Either one. We tell Baylor, get you another time. Oh, well, that's definitely a thing. Um, <laughs> plus 43 fire resist. Uh, I cannot believe what just happened. This is impossible. Let us see what is happening on the street. That's definitely interesting. Level 95. Um, I'm trying to see jewels. We're going to lock that one. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what is this? A polished... What kind of... Oh, it's a square. We have... And I, I'm still farming Dark Moor team. Uh, yeah. It's a struggle, as you can imagine. Oh, yeah, we do... The, but the main pieces of gear do not have the jewel crafting yet, which I actually am happy about. Uh, do we have any squares? No squares, huh? I wonder what squares are for. Probably, like top tier gear I don't know that's something that's interesting 43 resist though but I don't think that's like actual resist I think it's like a percentage wise that it's kind of an interesting system still quiet out here good I was afraid there might be open fighting I truly did not expect you to say anything that would have changed my mind or my allegiance spellbinder but Warlord Baylor has turned me fully to your side. That's what I want to hear, Spicy. If Warlord Baylor has demoted Zelda and sought to imprison me, it makes sense he'll go for Zorak next. Zorak is the third member of the Troika Council. He is the representative of the Workers' Guild. 
Spellbinder, can you hurry over to Zorak's home and warn him? He's probably going to be abducted. Alrighty, team. That'll do it for me today. Uh, next time, we'll make our way over to, well, Zorak's house or whoever that was. Uh, I'm going to look up on the wiki how much left we have to do. Tomorrow might be a little bit of a longer ep as well. If you've enjoyed, please leave a like. It's always appreciated. Check out my Twitter down below. Follow it for random shenanigans updates. I'll see you all next time. Watch out this week for a potential jewel crafting series on my death. Starting that out as well. Um, and then maybe some... Uh, be streaming some Aphrodite with friends in Darkmoor. Um, and then also probably some Darkmoor in my myth. A lot of Darkmoor things this week, I believe. Uh, so yeah. Take care, team. I'll see you all later.